to look more and more like title contenders with every passing game. The people. CF Chelsea pierced through. Olivier Giroud, the man in blue. Challenge, I mean, Chelsea are going great guns. I mean, the noise is coming out the camp. They probably won't thank me. You know, if I'm the hype man, I'll, I'm really excited. And, and I'm seeing parallels <laughs> with tight, great title teams. You know, when you're in this situation like Chelsea, you want to go about your business quietly. You don't need someone like me in the media telling everyone how great <laughs> they are all the time. But I'm just so excited to watch this team. I love it. Uh, it's been done before. Very good. Right, gents, thank you very much for your company so far. Right, kickoff comes next then between Everton and Chelsea. Don't forget, this is a game that's delivered plenty of drama and plenty of goals over the years, especially in their meetings last season. Degrees here, but that doesn't stop them on Merseyside from getting an ice cream in before the game starts. And this is where we are this evening. And certainly there'll be some uh, TVs tuned to BT Sport on that street because although the fact that there are 2,000 fans in here this evening, there are many more that would love to be... Ten changes in the Champions League. Tonight's team shows one change from the team that beat Leeds last weekend. Mateo Kovacic for Hakim Ziyech is the alteration. It means Kovacic, Kante and Mount will be in midfield with Havertz up with Werner and Giroud. Chelsea without three wide players tonight, Pulisic and Hudson-Odoi, as well as Ziyech, Kai Havertz is the only starter who starts. Solidarity be shown by the two sets of players here inside Goodison. And on by Sigurdsson, back to Richarlison, promising. Needed to be a better finish. He's in a bit of a slump at the moment, Richarlison hasn't scored for five. Kai Havertz is up there with him. Rhys James arriving from right back with a chance, and that's a really good tackle. By a Roby's managed to win the corner. Some good defending. And what you would say about the two Everton fullbacks tonight is that they are central defenders yeah. as well. Sigurdsson's ball, Mina's header, and always a little bit too high. <laughs> Lifted in by Kovacic, cleared away by Keane, and then. Uh, Nice ball. Zuma looking for Havertz. Good position taken up there by the Everton goalkeeper, Jordan yeah, well, Pickford. A little bit. Sigurdsson was in there quickly. Foul. He's got the free kick as well. Yeah. Foul. James. Timo Werner. Jordan Pickford was aware the ball had. Iwobi's cross. Cleared away by Zuma. Bent, of course. Sigurdsson floats the ball in. Olivier Giroud defending for Chelsea. Out there to Richarlison. For Dominic Calvert Lewin. Good take by Mendy. And Werner was quickly on the run. Good header by Mina. Tonight. Headed on by Calvert Lewin. And the oh. goalkeeper has taken him out, and it's a penalty. Well, that was easy, wasn't it? Well, no sooner were we praising him. And he scores very, very elegantly and very, very calmly. And Everton lead Chelsea 1-0. How cool was that? Gilfie Sigurdsson, calm as you like. Strolls up to the penalty, just knocks it nonchalantly past Mendy. Toffees a one up. Another chance for James to hit one. Oh, he's hit the post. So close to a Chelsea equaliser. Richarlison dispossessed there by Rhys James. And clumsy by the Brazilian trying to win it back. It's Rhys James who hits it, and his England teammate Jordan Pickford makes the save. Yeah. Pickford's ball intercepted by Kovacic. Here's Havertz for Chelsea. Fouled by Alan. Free kick taken by Chilwell. In towards Olivier Giroud. Kurt Zuma! Oh, straight at the goalkeeper. And now they're a central defender like Chelsea. Although uh, Edouard Mendy was acting as a sweeper back there. Pitch. Looking to tee up Rhys James, who whips in the cross, which is just a fraction high. 
for uh, Timo Werner, and then really cut at left back for Everton. Yeah. Made a really good start to his career here at Goodison Park, Ben Godfrey. Yeah, Pickford looks as if he's struggling. They're all kind. Kovacic. In goes Werner, and just over the top of the bar. Yeah, it was a hole gate, wasn't it? It was a corner. And he's oh, given he's, the goal he's kick, given John goal kick. Good ball by Rhys James. He's a, it's Mason Mount in by Olivier Giroud. Well, can I have one? It was a good position. It was a really nice first touch from him. He's running to his own man there, Pickford. Giroud yeah. with the chance. Oh, Kovacic. Rhys James forward again. Deep cross towards Ben Chilwell. Rhys James has had the best opportunities for Chelsea. And Olivier Giroud was wrestling with Yerry Mina, which yeah. just. Chilwell's cross towards Timo Werner, who just couldn't quite reach it. Just managed there to get home. Drills in the ball towards Gilfie Sigurdsson. And the last touch, in fact, was off the Everton. The Everton supporters inside Goodison Park, you can hear. It's food for thought for Frank Lampard, because his team trail to uh, Gilfie. Thank you, Jay. Thank you, fellas. So we'll see whether Chelsea can preserve their unbeaten away record in the Premier League this season. And they've got to improve on what we saw in the first half. He came and committed himself and did well. Then it's lifted back in. Oh, audacious attempt there by Mason Mount, who took it really, really well with Jordan Pickford stranded. So unlucky. I was very surprised that an Everton defender didn't run on the line. Been on running, Olivier Giroud can pick up the pieces, squeeze in the cross and headed behind by Mason Holgate, they're Divkini. Yeah, the top balcony. Sat up there many a time. Richarlison, Calvert-Lewin waiting. Richarlison shot, Mendy save. Here's him by Kante. Here's Ben Godfrey. That's a foul by Olivier Giroud. Yeah, he just got his body. He does take the shot on. Oh, not sure whether he slipped there, Mendy, but I'm not sure he... Sigurdsson. Good ball. That's a better ball. And it was taken away by Calvert-Lewin by Yerry Mina. Rhys James manages to get the cross in, but Jordan Pickford, <laughs> who's having a good game himself back there for Everton. Yeah, this is where you can see Everton are going to be at the best. Jim Beglin beside me. Well, I can tell you, I'm truly delighted to join you, Peter, and, and thank you very much for that. A moment for pride and reflection as players and supporters stand for the 